hey what's going on guys welcome back to another video today we're going to be doing question number 10 hpa so we have to create a new horizontal power auto scaler named apache server in auto scaling space this one has to target the existing deployment called apache deployment in the same namespace and has to target a 50 percent cpu usage per pod minimum one pod and maximum four pods and we have to set the downscale stabilization window to 30 seconds so let's start this by checking the deployment that we have in the auto scale namespace. Oh, sorry. Okay, and as you can see, we have the Apache deployment here. So let's go clear the screen. Now we're gonna go to the Kubernetes documentation page, search for HPA, and we're gonna click on the third one because here we have the YAML files. Scroll down, and you're gonna copy this specific one. Copy. And we're gonna paste it using the VI editor, of course. So we're gonna put the name of the YAML file hpa1.yaml, paste it here, and let's go up and put the name here as Apache server. And here, kind deployment, okay? We're targeting uh, deployment, of course. So the name of the deployment is Apache deployment. So let's do this perfect minimum replicas is one as per the question and maximum is four cpu utilization um, in the question says 50 percent so that's fine we're gonna leave it like that and we have to put the downscale stabilization window to 30 seconds so for that we have to go back to the kubernetes documentation page and we're gonna click on the first one go down to the part where it says behavior so let's see uh, we have behavior here but we need this one so it's scale down stabilization windows seconds let's copy this one and we're gonna paste it right here at the bottom so let's check the typo as you can see the s has to be a little bit more forward than the b so we're gonna put it like this and let me see if it's aligned with the m okay perfect uh, i forgot here to specify the namespace so the namespace is out to scale that's very important and also the api version is has to be v2 because only the version v2 supports the behavior scale down stabilization window so that's very important because if you do v1 on the exam it's not gonna work so yeah the downscale stabilization in 30 seconds this looks fine let's go ahead and create the file and as you can see the apache server is created let me clear the screen and let's confirm that is in the auto scale namespace and as you can see we have it so that's gonna be it for this video guys thank you so much for the support and i'll see you on the next one